Good morning. How are you today? It is Sunday, July 23rd, 2023 at 6.33 a.m. Coming to you from the East Coast of the United States. Let's find out what the weather's going to do today. Alexa, what's the weather today? The current weather is 74 degrees Fahrenheit with mostly cloudy skies. Today, you can look for thunderstorms with a high of 85 degrees and a low of 72 degrees. Wow. So it's gone from being in the mid to high 90s every day to an expected high of only 85 today. Wow. We have had heat advisories every afternoon for days, but now it's going to be cooled off. That'll be nice. Okay, so I thought this morning I wanted a cup of coffee that was not super strong. So I thought, well, let me go ahead and get one of these Nespresso filter style coffees, which are unusual. And I thought I'll do this because, you know, a lot of people haven't seen this, so it's got a little tab thing here. Can you see that? And you pull it off. And there appears this. See all the little holes in there? How can I show you this? Okay. And um, that's just my stand knocking around on the stove here. And then what you're supposed to do, this is for the original line. First, you're supposed to, oh, I better put a cup under here, oh boy. Yes, it's early in the morning and I need my coffee. <laughs> First, you put a cup under here. Then you push the Lungo button, okay? And I don't have any milk in here because I just want to see how high it comes up in the glass. So a Lungo, remember, is 3.7 ounces, okay? But then it's not done. Then you're supposed to push the espresso button. That's 1.35 ounces. So that makes makes about five ounces altogether. And I imagine running so much water through here is going to make it taste more like a, you know, Mr. Coffee sort of thing, more like a drip coffee than, um, oh yeah, it's very see-through. Can you see through that? So, I'm just gonna, well, that, <laughs> normally the coffee's very dark here. Let, I'll take you along with me. Let me get some milk. Okay, here we go. And obviously I'm not gonna put a whole lot of milk in this. Well, I guess I could put it in the microwave, but it's, <laughs> it's very um, weak looking. I have to say. And it's definitely weak looking. Alright. So I'll give this a try. <laughs> it tastes like a cup of American coffee. Um, maybe a little bit stronger flavor. You know what? I'm gonna make it a super milky coffee and I'm gonna pop it in the microwave. And let me pop this back in the fridge here. Okay, let's see, I'll give it 30, whoops. Uh-oh, I pushed the wrong button. My gosh, okay. Oh, 
you know, usually I don't even have to think about what b button to push. My finger just goes there. But this time I was trying to see. <laughs> I got the wrong button. I need to use these sometimes and other times. Just let it be. Oh, you know what? I'm going to open up the blinds today since it's not going to be that hot. That'll be nice. I think it's been raining a lot of the night. So there we go. We're done. You're taking trips around my kitchen with me. All righty. Now, I can see that this is hot. Can you see the smoke, the steam coming up? Give it a stir around. So, okay, here's the thing. It does, it has a bolder flavor than a lot of American coffees, but I don't know, it's not, it's not as good as all the other capsules that I have. And the tongue feel of it, the consistency in your mouth, it's just, it's so thin, it's, I don't know. You know what I'm going to do? Let's see. I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to put some salted caramel syrup in here um, in hopes that that will improve things. I honestly don't know if it will. Okay, I don't want to put too much or else it will taste like I'm having some salted, what, salted caramel with a little bit of coffee instead of coffee with a little bit of salted caramel. Okay. So, yeah, this is Nespresso, if you're listening. This is a sleeve of coffee I will never buy again. <laughs> but, I've said this before, it just came back to me. If you share a coffee machine with someone who does not like these stronger, more characterful espressos and lungos in the capsules that I usually use, well, and they prefer drip coffee, this would be perhaps a good compromise. This is an Intenso. I think they also have a, I don't know, Chiaro or Whatever, I think they have like a light and a bold, and this is the bold. Oh, do I want to make believe I'm just having a cup of American coffee? I hate to waste things. Oh, golly, you know what? Oh, I can't believe I'm going to do this. I'm going to pour it out. Oh, dear. And um, maybe I'll, you know, I'll hang on to the, the rest of the sleeve. If I have a friend that comes over that isn't an espresso type drinker or does not drink coffees that have, are made with a base of espresso, then I'll say, how about a nice drip coffee? And I'll give them one of these to drink. They probably like it. Let me try one more time. Wait, I had an idea. You know, I'm sort of having deja vu here. I might have done this before. I'm going to take a stronger capsule, stronger in flavor. Like, how about, do I have Roma here? Wait, let me put on the reading glasses, because, you know. Okay, Paris Espresso, Levanto, Honduras, Milano, Roma, okay. I'll use Rome. And hopefully, I'm not going to be wasting this Roma by doing this. I'm going to go ahead and extract it. Hopefully, this will sort of beef up the, uh, you know, the character of the pot. This needs a stronger character here. Okay, there we go. Do 
you know, and you may well say, well, you know, why did she put all that milk in? But honestly, it wasn't that great beforehand. I was sort of hoping maybe the milk would make a difference. Let's see here. So this is better, but you know what? There's a sort of a, a taste or a sensation from that filter style coffee that I mean, it's not that great. Uh, I am gonna drink this. You know, it's not terrible. It's not, it's almost okay. Does that sound awful? Um, actually, because I'm running out of time, I need to leave for church soon. <laughs> I don't want to have to, you know, sit and make a whole other cup of coffee and have a dirty cup. I have a clean dishwasher sitting there waiting to be emptied. Yeah, I'll have, I'll have something with it. It'll make it okay. <laughs> well, that was interesting this morning. I'll have to remember to just give that filter style coffee a miss next time. Well, look, I hope you have a lovely day. I hope you've got a little relief from the heat and I'll talk to you soon, okay?